Mabuhay! Welcome to Class for Everyone. Ako si Roland Corpus, aking tatalakayin. Ang isang word problem involving rational expression. At ito ang problem. Find two consecutive odd integers whose sum of the reciprocal is 24 over 143. The first thing that we're going to do in solving a word problem is to make a representation of the unknown. The unknown here are two consecutive odd integers. So we will let x be the first odd integer. So the next consecutive odd integer will be x plus 2 be the second odd integer. Now, we said that we are going to find for the sum of the reciprocal. The reciprocal of the first odd integer is 1 over x. The reciprocal of the second integer is 1 over x plus 2. We will get the sum. It is equal to 24 over 143. To solve for this rational, rational equation, we will have to find for the LCD. There is no common factor between the denominators, so the LCD will be the product of the denominators. x times x plus 2 times 143. LCD times 1 over x, we can cancel this. The remaining will be 143 times x plus 2, which is equal to 143x plus 286. LCD divided uh, times 1 over x plus 2, we can divide this out. The remaining will be x times 143, so plus 143x. 24 over 143 times the LCD, we can divide this out, so what remains will be 24x squared. 24x times 2 is positive 48x. Rewriting it into standard form, all of these terms, the opposite, all of them are negative, so we will have 0 is equal to 24x squared plus 48x <coughs> minus 143 and 143 is 286x minus 286. So, combining this, we will have 24x squared, and that will be 8, 3, 2, negative 238x minus 286. And then rewriting it into standard form on the left side, by symmetric property, we will have 24x squared minus 200. 38x minus 286 equals 0. All of the numerical coefficients are divisible by 2. So we can simplify this by multiplying it by 1 half. So we will have a simplified form of 12x squared minus 119x minus 143 equals 0. Now, since we are looking for integers, this quadratic uh, trinomial must be factorable. By factoring, we can have 12x and then x. And then we will have positive 13 minus 11. Let us check. 12x times x is 12x squared. 12x times negative 11 is negative 143. Plus 13x is negative 119. 13 times 11, negative 11 is negative 143. So my factors are correct. So using the zero product, we'll have 12x plus 13 equals, we will have equal to zero. So 12 x equals negative 13, x equals negative 13 over 12. 
The next factor, x minus 11 equals 0. Therefore, x equals 11. What is being asked is an integer. This is not an integer. This is a non-integer. So this is the answer. If, going back to the representation, if x is the first integer, then x plus 2 is 13. Therefore, the two odd integers are 11 and 13.